the Mavericks. Thanks for coming to the print shop. Yeah, thanks for having Thank us. Thank you, man. Thank R you. Raul, you've been here one other time. Yeah. And this is a treat to see you grace our presence here at the print shop for the second time. Thank you, man. Yeah, I, I brought the cavalry with yes, me this you time.
back in your arms. That's that's what you started the night off. Yeah, and man, we've been opening the sets with that. We've been opening the shows with that because it's it kind of feels appropriate. You know, it's like we're we're back in your arms again. You know, and uh, that was the song that got the band the back together. That was the first song that we had all sat down to play in the studio. We didn't like go into a rehearsal hall or anything. We just decided, well, let's just throw ourselves in the studio and let's see if we can start making a record. And that was the first song that we recorded when we got back together. We had not played before that. So what you hear on the In Time record, that's, mm -hmm. I think that's the first take of that track. What a story. Yeah. That's poetic. Yeah. So you write this song, you record it one and done, and that's what we hear. And, that's, yeah. and that started this whole new era of awesome. the Mavericks. <laughs> Life isn't easy, it's a pill, believe me, whether you're weak or you're strong. Sometimes it feels like you're back on your heels And everything's going all wrong Through the confusion and all this illusion Somehow life still goes on I found a cure I know works for sure And we'll just keep rolling along So bring on the trouble and burst every bubble I promise it won't change a thing
feel it deep in my soul. I think I mentioned that last time you were here. This is a prime example, this record. Sure. This is one of my favorite records, your newest release in Espanol. And La Citiera, yeah. I, I, I listen to every day on my sure. hike. And it just takes me on a journey. And I don't necessarily understand what you're saying, sure. but it's like an opera, right? Yeah. No one really understands that as well. Yeah, but this, I think you can pick up, you can, but emotion is emotion and, and you can hear it in the delivery you can you can get a sense of what the song is about you know just like you can with opera and and sometimes you know sometimes man you hear a piece of music and you don't understand a word and you find yourself crying by the end of it it's like why am i crying i didn't even understand yeah. this but that's the power of music i think Tiene tu calor. Hoy es el día que de partir nuestros caminos se separarán. Ya nuestra historia llegó a su fin. Bellos recuerdos en mí quedarán. Oh, 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 oh. tus recuerdos me acompañarán. 
you guys known each other? I mean, you guys go way back. We were introduced to a mutual, by a mutual friend years yeah. ago. So we've been friends like, uh, I mean, a long time, even before he even asked me, because uh, I remember at one point I'd finally moved to Nashville and we were hanging out. I mean, we were, <clears throat> We were tearing it up downtown in Nashville a lot yeah. <laughs> yeah. back in those days. But, uh, and then he just kind of had the notion, hey man, I got a couple of these solo shows. You think you want to go play some, some gig? And he had never heard me play guitar. So yeah. we had just been friends, really? like hanging buddies for like years. <laughs> we had never played music together. And so you'd never heard him play guitar? You no, just heard no, through no. the grapevine? Not really. And, yeah, no. I just figured, I mean, he talked a good game. That was yeah. good enough for me. <laughs> You know, <laughs> I love that. I knew all the right people. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I knew man. all the people he knew. If you came up to me wearing that and you said, "Adam, I'm a badass guitar player," I would believe. Come it. on, see man. what I mean? There's Come no on. doubt about yeah, it. Yeah, I, mean? I get it. Yeah, I get it. I'm like, how bad can it be? Totally good. Yeah. Uh, totally good.
So La Citiera is doing very well. I mean, this yeah. this thing is um, taking the world by storm in a lot of ways. It, it's it's charted number one in the in the Latin charts. Is that correct? Yeah. Well, the the album did. Yes. The, the album did. Yeah, in excuse Espanol. me. I meant yeah, the, yeah, yeah, in Espanol. In yeah. Yeah. It uh, during, you know, during the the record. You know, we, we recorded it over the last couple of years as we were on the road recording other things, this and that. We'd take a break. You know, we'd come in off the road and it's like we had a few days. Let's go into the studio. And so throughout the tour of the last couple of years, it got recorded. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, uh, the, 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 the the David Macias, uh, who's the head of 30 Tigers, you know, when's this record going to be ready? When's and I said, man, not yet. You know, get out of my kitchen. Get out. <laughs> yeah. It's not ready yet. Uh, and then the pandemic hit, and it just so happens that we had just finished the record, right as as things were going into lockdown. So we had to clearly, you know, pivot, you know, or just well, uh, these are this is what we got to do, and we got to promote this record now. Let's release it; it's ready. You know, people are home. Let's release. Let's give them music. Mm -hmm. You know, and man. We released it, and it went out into the world, and it landed number one on the Billboard Latin Pop Chart. Wow. You know, as it debuted, which is nothing short of a miracle. I mean, it's it's really, like, I was really impressed. I'm still impressed. I can't believe it that we, you know, and it's probably the only time that we'll be mentioned in the same sentence as Maluma and Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny. Yeah. You know? <laughs> that Tanto tiempo disfrutamos de este amor Nuestras almas se acercaron tanto así Que yo guardo tu sabor Pero tú llevas también sabor a mí Si negaras mi presencia en tu vivir Bastaría con abrazarte y conversar Tanta vida yo te di Que por fuerza tienes ya sabor a mí No pretendo ser tu dueño No soy nada y yo no tengo vanidad de mi vida doy lo bueno soy tan pobre que otra cosa puedo dar pasarán más de mil años y muchos más yo no sé si tenga amor la eternidad pero allá tal como aquí en la boca llevarás Sabor a mí Ser tu dueño No soy nada Yo no tengo vanidad De 
de mi vida Doy lo bueno Soy tan pobre que otra cosa puedo dar Pasarán más de mil años Y muchos más Yo no sé si tenga amor La eternidad Pero allá tal como aquí En la boca llevarás Sabor a mí Sabor a mí So you guys, when I think about the Mavericks, I, I think about the two of you guys. I do. I mean, you're very recognizable, and you got one of the coolest looks going around. <laughs> Raul is 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 one of the smoothest guys that I, that I've ever met. You have this this sense about you, both of you. You have this presence about you. And the thing that I love, I'm going to talk about you because this is on the top of my mind. The thing that I like about you the most is that your voice is is driving and your smile is riding shotgun. That's the way that I put it. You're <laughs> always smiling and you just give this this aura about you that just makes people feel comfortable and warm and it's a special special thing you have going on. Well, thank you, man. Thank you. You know, I I I feel I feel fortunate to be able to play music for a living and and I know what music does and I know what music does to me and and to us and so I, I think it's a joyous I think I think playing music is a joyous occasion you know and so yeah we're we we're, we've been accused of of uh, of having a good time before you know and yeah. and and that's okay I I think uh, I, I you know when when people come to see us I want them I want them to forget about whatever's going on outside of that building you know for a little while for a couple hours. you 
can say to me. Coming on the we're on the the other side of the pandemic, the world is starting to open up. You're yeah. starting to you're playing shows, yeah. quite a bit of them now. Yeah. How's that being in front of your fans again? Oh man, um, it's wonderful. You know, um, it's funny. I, I think, you know, for me personally, I think a lot of people feel this way. Uh, that pandemic made me realize how much we take for granted. You know, just in all aspects of our lives, you know? Uh, and first and foremost to me is what we do. Like, cause that came to a screeching halt. No ifs, ands, or buts. That's it. It was, it was done. Our, our business relies solely on getting a couple of thousand people into a building without fear. Right. That's the difference. It's a huge responsibility. And, uh, and feel safe, you know, and, and that's, that's key to our business. And so we've been advocates for for that, you know, from the beginning. And I'm proud of the fact that we have done that. And, and you know, sure, it's ruffled a few feathers, I'm sure. And, and there are people that disagree with me, no doubt. But if you were if you were in my shoes, I don't know that you would disagree with me. Right. So with all its challenges, you know, it's been it's been beautiful getting back and it's been beautiful to see the people they just want to be out. They just want to live again. They yeah. want to be out here in music, and and if we got to do, if we got to make these small concessions, so be it. You know, I mean, honestly, I'd wear a hazmat suit if it got me out of the house. <laughs> you know, I think music is is kind of the key component to really kind of letting everyone step back and relax. The world has missed it tremendously. I mean, we've been without a lot of different things, yeah. but music, live music in particular, that and healing all, that happens yeah. when when people congregate for a concert, you know? Absolutely, and yeah. I, I've been thinking that, and, and I'm sure I'm not the only one that thinks this, but you know, the, all the divisiveness that's going on, I felt like if people could just stand shoulder to shoulder and sing songs together, that is a common thread that yeah. brings so it is. many people together. It is. You just relax, yeah. you know? You're not gonna fight about anything. I and see it all the time. It. Yeah. I see it in our audience. Like the morning sun 
ever, forever and ever you'll be my dream, my symphony, my own lover's theme. Ever and ever, forever and ever, my destiny will follow you eternally. Guys, I want to thank you again. You and the rest of your fantastic band. Thank you, man. For, for taking the time to come back to the print shop. Everyone, get this record in Espanol. It is freaking amazing. I said it the last time you're here. I'm going to keep selling this record because it is that good. It's one thank of my you. favorites. Thank you, brother. Thank and, you. Uh, thanks again, man. Yeah, thanks for you having You guys us. are awesome. <laughs> All right, man. Love thank you, brother. you so much. Thank man. you, pal. See you. Thank you. Party is here. Mira, Ricardo, sonaste maravilloso. No te puedo explicar el sonido que ha salido de tu pecho, de tu alma. Es algo especial, tan especial, que ojalá se repita. Bueno, hasta luego, felicidades.